to begin, to begin how to start. I'm hungry. I should get coffee. Coffee would help me think. But I should write something first, then reward myself with coffee. Coffee and a muffin. Okay, so I need to establish the themes. Maybe banana nut. That's a good muffin. It's really easy to overthink what you're writing. It's really easy to worry about, oh, where's the plot going to go? Where are the characters going to go? Who are these people? But the most important thing is just getting words on paper or on the screen. It can seem really overwhelming, but stop critiquing yourself. Stop worrying too much about it and just put stuff down. It's not going to be perfect, and you can worry about editing it later. But the hardest part is getting started. So I hope you just get started. That's all you have to worry about. Believe that the story you want to tell is important and that once you put that story out there, other people are going to love it. So Write the story for yourself, um, investigate what your truths are, and then have faith in it, and let the audience that's meant to find it, find it. What one word could you give people starting out? And the word that immediately flashed into my head was courage. Now it's time to take those details you've collected in previous steps and start writing your draft. Before you begin, make sure you are still focused on your theme. Can you answer these two questions? What happened and why does it matter? Don't worry about perfecting your opening sentence. Word count isn't important yet either. Content is key. Just write. give me anything about writer's block. When you have writer's block, write. You know, that's how you unblock. You may write junk, and I do this all the time, but when you go back and read that chapter, you'll go, well, this is junk, and you rewrite it. No book is written. Every book is rewritten. Write what you know, write what you believe in. Writing brought you solace. Yeah, well, what I write about. Anything. Whatever brings you ease. A memory. A thought. A place. 